Need some coins or MT for that God Squad you've always wanted? For the fastest and cheapest coins anywhere, make sure to check out MMOEXP.com and use code ZERK for 5% off your order. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing. So I've been getting asked like crazy to come back and do a present prediction video going over all of the presents, what I think they're going to be, do I think maybe they're going to be worth it, and today we're going to do that. I do want to give a shout out to Cammy Boy for being a part of the Noti Gang. If you guys want a chance to shout out in the next video, drop a like in the vid, make sure you guys are subbed to the channel, turn the notification bell on and comment down below, Noti Gang. Also you guys, as part of Zerg Miss, every single day I'm giving away $25 worth of underdog fantasy fun, so if you guys want to enter for that giveaway, just retweet that tweet, follow me over on Twitter. Twitter and comment down below on that tweet zerk and as long as you guys signed up or do sign up on underdog fantasy using code zerk you're eligible for the giveaway by the way last night guys was a pretty solid day four wins we had a 60 dollar nflw a 15 dollar nba and my dad once again has been just dominating with the nba he had two 90 dollar w's today we have the nba but don't forget guys we actually have nfl games on on saturday starting this week so tomorrow we actually have NFL and Sunday we have NFL, so I'll have picks for both days at NBA Today. And also, guys, I'm giving away these two Xbox Series S's and the PlayStation 5. And if you guys went for that giveaway, drop a like in the vid, make sure you're sub, and comment down below to see what we're on this video and every video because the end of December I'm gonna go through and select three random videos and select those winners. So comment down below, reveal and leave a way to contact you for Twitter or Instagram. All right, guys, so we're going to go ahead and go through every single present. Now, I'm not going to use my face cam, so that way you guys can see pretty much all the details on these presents and everything. But uh, I have almost every single present. I think the only one I actually don't have is one of the super rares, which obviously we'll work on that, and we will definitely get that before Christmas comes around. So I will showcase for you guys what that one is uh, over on Twitter. I've gone over it, I think, since, like, day one of the promo or the ea reveal stream my guess has not changed for that one starting off let's go ahead here and take a look at the small presents as i said i'm gonna go through literally all of them here so small present this one obviously is zero chill now as you guys can see it does quick sell for 810 training points and a lot of people have been asking me you know should i quick sell my medium present should i quick sell uh my small presents what should i do in my opinion, guys, I don't really think that you should quick sell pretty much any presents, to be honest with you, uh, because when you quick sell presents, that is when you just lose out right? You lose out, and especially small ones. Year after year, smalls have actually been kind of one of the better gifts. It just always seems to be that way. So what do I think this could be? You have to look at the training value of it, okay? 810 training. What is that actually worth? Well, an 83 overall quick sells for 650 and an 84 overall quick sells for 970. Now, if this is a zero chill player though, here's the thing. As of right now, the lowest overall zero chill players are 82 overalls. So I fully expect that this pack right here, guys, is gonna be an 82 plus overall zero chill player. Now, will that be a bad thing? No. Because I'm telling you right now, you might think, oh, just 82 pluses, that's not very good. Yeah, you pull 82 overall, obviously, you know, you would have been better off quick selling it, but you're going to get some good pulls. You might pull a 90 overall, which will be 10,000 training, which will pay for 12 of these packs. You might even pull a limited out of a small present. It happens every single year to a lot of people. So small present, I think that one is just going to be an 82 plus overall uh, zero chill now we also have this aka present as well which is a thousand and thirty training now with this one again ak also has very very similar overalls they do have 82 overalls they have 83 overalls they also have 84 overalls which 84 overalls do quick sell for 970 training points so this could be an 84 plus it could be an 83 plus could be an 82 plus one of the three but again i i really don't think it's worth quick selling your small presence at all uh we also have the harvest this as well 1070 training similar right harvest promo 82 83 84 plus whichever way which if you're curious with the harvest promo there are 80 overalls and then it jumps to 84 so i mean we could be looking at 80 overall pluses for these harvest presents which i've seen just a ton of these being pulled by the way uh so that would Kind of be tough, but I'm kind of making my predictions as if EA maybe doesn't want all of these gifts to necessarily guarantee you profit. They could be good, right? These honestly could be good. And something like the small present, let's say EA somehow, some way wanted to be nice. Well, they can make it 85 plus, but 
I really doubt that because more than likely that's going to be the medium present. And speaking of medium present, we get into the medium zero chill present. As you guys can see, it's 2830 training which would be right in between an 86 and 87 overall, which I don't believe that EA will allow you to get guaranteed a profit off of this and make it 87 plus, anything like that. More than likely, these medium presence guys, a lot of them are going to be 85 pluses, uh, maybe even 84 fours you could potentially think right because an 85 is 1400 training points you quick this for 2830 i don't think 85 overall would be all that bad uh as that's for the legends of course and also for medium present you see 2830 right here for medium present the legend one is 2900 they could very well be the same exact overall though maybe even with zero chill because this should be 85 plus and then the legend one just being slightly more I think they're honestly both just going to be 85 plus. And as well, the team of the week present, 2,910 training. I think all three of these, just 85 plus overalls. Now getting into the Blitz present, you guys can see this does quick sell for 7,120 training, which would put this between 89 and 90 overall, 89 overalls quick sell uh, for 6,800 training. I actually think that is going to be literally any blitz player i think it's just gonna be i think i want to say it's an 88 overall is the lowest overall blitz player i think it's gonna be 88 plus overall blitz player which honestly could be pretty cool i will say though the only 88 overall blitz player we have is dane belton and then after that everybody else is you know 89 90s whatever so let's say it's an 89 plus let's say dane belton is excluded for 7100 training points maybe now here's where we run into a present though that really kind of throws things for a loop right because if we think the medium present is going to be an 85 plus right and we think the large present is going to be a 90 plus overall zero chill here's the thing it only goes with zero chill anyways from 85 to 90 overall so we do think the medium present is going to be an 85 overall well then that would make the large a 90 plus right but the issue is a 90 overall quick sells for 10,000 training so is this present actually one of the best presents because it only quick sells for 7650 training and a 90 overall be a guarantee 10k so is ea actually giving us guaranteed profit every single one of these that i don't know but i will say this as well we still have another part of zero chill to come out right should be having another part of zero chill this thursday maybe there's going to be lower overalls implemented in there because right now we only have 85s and then it jumps to 90 pluses so large present i'm gonna guess 90 plus overall zero chill which would be amazing if that is the case uh now though we get into the harder presents to guess right we have the lively large present when you look at this and you look at the training value you can see that it is 10,450 training as i just said 90 overalls quick sell for 10k so this is between a 90 to a 91 overall the thing is though when i look at the thing on it when i look at the actual present itself and i look at the colors i see team diamond or team affinity now if it were to be a team diamond this would be amazing because team diamonds are all 92 overalls which are way above the value of this i'm kind of leaning more towards a team affinity player uh maybe an 89 plus overall because 89s quick sell for 6800 and then we have the 92s so i think that maybe this could be an 89 plus overall team affinity and now we get into in my opinion guys probably the hardest gift out here to guess the lovely large present what is this present as you can see it's purple there are hearts on it and that's it uh there's no promo currently in the game guys that have purple hearts or hearts in general i will be honest i really really am kind of clueless with this one i mean this is like the one gift that i will be just say i don't know what this is uh you guys can let me know down below your predictions but here's the other thing right these aren't specific players these are definitely all promo related player plus options i don't know i i really have absolutely no clue on this one i've seen people guess anything from somehow team of the week some people think this could be maybe a stocking stuffer 92 overall whatever it's 14,000 training points which if you look at the lovely 
and you look at the lively and all of these ones right so that's 14,000 training points this one is 10,000 training points and then if we come down here and we go to this one the gold you can see this is actually 18,000 training points so the lovely is in between the other two and I'll be honest, I, I just don't have a prediction for you guys. I have no clue. I'm completely clueless on that one. I think that one's going to be the most interesting one to see what it is on Christmas Day, to be honest. But getting into the lavish large, I do believe this is one of two things. This is either all Madden or Redux. I've been saying Redux since like the promo started pretty much that I think this is because it has almost like the same exact goldish right reveal for reduxes which I feel like if anything this is probably going to be a 90 or 91 plus overall redux 91 overall players quick sell for 15,000 training points so that could be the case or 90 overalls quick sell for 10k could be either of those two but I actually think this would be a pretty good gift there are a lot of reduxes that go for a lot and obviously are higher overall and they continue to implement new and new reduxes we just got a bunch of them like night train lane for all the blitz cards whatever i think this would be a really good gift now we've gone over all of the gifts that actually have quick sell values so now let's take a look at the ones that don't actually have quick sell values and let's start off with the three gifts that you had to get from the bundle that just came out right now i will say this i'm not the biggest fan of these gifts only being in that like $50 pack offer or whatever but that's the only way to get these gifts here and kind of think of it as like a bundle topper pretty much the way to think about it is but you guys can see you can no longer quick sell these initially when it came out you could quick sell them but they took that option away and I've said this since yesterday as well but as you guys can see we have the frosty gift we also have the icebreaker gift right here as well and then the final of the three gifts all the way over here is the snowy gift i think these are ghosts we definitely are going to be getting ghosts i don't know when hopefully we'll be getting gifts early on next week i hope we don't have to wait until thursday but i most certainly think that we will see ghosts of madden implemented in very very soon if you guys go to the xbox store and you look at like the details of madden 23 it literally says ghosts of madden so they most certainly are set to come and i think it makes sense right we got three different presents here frosty icebreaker and snowy one of these is probably Ghost of Madden Present, Ghost of Madden Past, and Ghost of Madden Future. That's my guesses for those three. Now we get into the two rarest gifts. And as you guys can see right here, the, we have the Player Present 2. Now, I actually don't have the Player Present 1, but I will showcase for you guys what that one is. I'm sure you already know what that one is. But the Player Present 2, there are a lot of different possibilities for this, but I will say this. There are two people on the island it says no ag zone and it seems to be a mountain of sorts so i have a couple of potential options number one no ag zone i most certainly think that this is a defensive player this definitely is a defensive player and i feel like it has to be someone in the secondary with no ag zone most certainly i would say probably a corner right now no ag zone to me could mean a couple of things obviously aggressive catches are really op whatever it could just be ea saying no ag zone blah blah or it could be a playoff of no fly zone from the denver broncos right now who was a part of the no fly zone akib talib i do think it's possible that we could see this be a akib talib card maybe a champ bailey obviously champ bailey was not a part of the no fly zone but he was a denver bronco or this could be cornerback ed too tall jones no ag zone yeah you put a six foot nine corner out there i really hope you want to get aggressive caught on so those are really my two predictions i would say akib talib or cornerback too tall and getting into the final gift here guys it is the unfinished business the player present one i do not have this one yet but i will most certainly try my best to get it of course to have it on christmas day I've said this since day one. I've literally said this. You go back and watch the video of the entire reveal, whatever. I said this is Tom Brady, and I'm sticking with it. I think it's Tom Brady. Unfinished business just makes too much sense. Uh, also, I personally can't make it out, but apparently people are making out on the side of this like box here somewhere. It says like Tampa Airport. I think it's like TAP or something. The initials of the Tampa Airport. I most certainly think this is Tom Brady. Now, do I think this is going to be uh, the AKA Tom Brady? No, it's not going to be that. I think there's two different ways this could go. We either get a scrambler Tom Brady like we did last year, right? It could be a super fast Tom Brady, which would be kind of cool. Or 
wide receiver Brady. Brady has actually lined up at wide receiver this year versus the Seahawks. It led to an interception, but he didn't line up at wide receiver. And I think it'd either be that, either Scrambler Brady or it could be wide receiver Brady. And also, if you guys take a look here, right, at Tom Brady's tweet of him coming back from retirement. I tweeted this out last night. At the end there, it says, unfinished business. So without a doubt to me, I think this is Brady. I think a lot of people have different people than they could be. Like, I saw someone saying OBJ. I've seen Colin Kaepernick, potentially. I've seen people saying this could be uh, Patrick Mahomes because he lost the Super Bowl in Tampa. I think it's Brady. With that being said, guys, those are my present predictions going over all of them. And again, I apologize. I just really don't have a prediction uh, for the lovely one. It's impossible, to be honest, for someone to accurately get that or at least based on the evidence in it. I just don't really see anything in there. With that being said, guys, I hope you did enjoy the video. And if you did, make sure you guys drop a like video. And of course, hit that sub button down below. And let me know down below your guys' present predictions. And if you guys enjoyed this video, check out these.